What up, YouTube? We back. Got another quick five hatch for y'all. Run through. They all pretty sturdy joints. Yeah, you know I mean, brought to you by your local Macari. All right, let's get started with this first one, y'all. All right, here we go. On well, this one right here, we got a we got a wool, a gray wool football spell out polo hat. Leather band, leather band in the back, black. You got the RLPC patch in the back. It's a newer model polo. Got the new blue label tag in the inside. You got the silk ribbon lining it. It's a pretty thick hat. Thick and sturdy. Made a Made it like 50% wool. The rest is acrylic. It's a nice hat though. And we got the exact same hat, but this time we got it in black. Ain't nothing really too much different from this one other than just that it's a black hat. That one was gray. These is real thick hats. Thick wintertime hats. Same thing, RLPC patch in the back. Black leather strap. Come hat. This one right here. This a vintage boy right here. This one probably. This one is 57% wool. It's just a, it's a kind of big pony. And a black. Three on the side. Brown leather patch. Polo Ralph Lauren spelled out on the back. If you don't know what this is, this MCM LX V2, that's 1967. Alright, huge pony in the front. Not a big fan of these, but I got this, this hat lot for pretty cheap, so you can't go wrong with it. This hat feel big too, like huge. Like bigger than the rest of these. Alright, ooh, this one still got the tag on it. Look at that. Let me know where she got this one from. She picked this up at Marshall's for a dub. Can't beat that dub on this hat, though. Thank you. I like all my hats with all my tags on there. She kept the tag on the joint for me. Good looking. It's a calm 4th of July status with the with the USA colors on it, with the flag, the main stars and stripes. It's a calm hat. Got a lot of stuff to match this hat right here. Quick go to boy. You can wear it with this blue, this black, that red, or this white. It's a calm hat right here. I'll be sure to wear this soon. And we got this other drink right here. It's Trucker NYC PRL Brooklyn Athletic Division. Got the pony in the back. Cloth strap. Blue label tag. That's another calm hat right here. I'm not a big fan of trucker hats, but I got this one for cheap. And it's black, so you can't really go wrong with it. Here we go. We got this classic RLPC tan and brown or tan and green canvas, whatever you want to call it. Fine quality goods established. 1967 New York Madison Avenue, proprietor 67. This is a calm classic hat right here, also. You can see by the tag in the inside. You got the leather strap in the back. RO Team Championship 381. So if you're a man like Red, who's it's a calm regular every day, Wednesday at the noon hat right there, y'all. Boom. This joint right here. This my color. Do they call it? Is this color block? Maybe color stripe. Color stripe. Got the blue, pink. And it's like teal green right here, turquoise, green, cloth strap in the back, newer tag, still got the tag on the jaw. 
This is another calm hat. I would call this a spring and summer hat. They actually got a jacket, a shirt. They might even have some pants to match this, this hat right here. It's real thin. It's just a, you know, cool breezy hat for the summer, for the spring. Then we got old boy right here. <laughs> Look at my man. This is one of my first corduroys. Classic. You can tell how old it is. Look at the back. Mm. Zoom in on that. It's a vintage polo. All red. Sweater bear. You got the fair all on with the beanie. It's polo boots. It's a thick hat, man. The weft on this on this corduroy is real thick. See that? Got the metal eyelets right here. They all getting corroded. You can tell this is just an old hat, man. I don't wear this joint too often, but it still look good on me, though. Polo spell out in the back. All right, hold up. Here we go. Got this boy right here. It's double RL. This is a, what do you call this, a varsity hat? Thinking it's like a varsity hat. It's all wool on the outside, and it get crazy linen. You get a bunch of hair and a bunch of lint on his head, y'all. So keep a lint brush with you. You got a beautiful leather strap in the back. You see that? You also got a you got a beautiful leather sweatband. Something I've I've only seen a few time on hats. I got a real classic fitted hat that got this in it. Look, look at the silk in this thing, y'all. Look at the gold silk. That is beautiful, man. You see this? Look how buttery this leather look. It's like a leather coat that they use. See? Thick under brim. Look at that, man. This is official hat right here from Double RL. Quality made. See that? It's one of my best hats right here, man. I love this hat. Good color, good symbol on the front. Still got the tag on the joint and everything, y'all. Still got the tag on the hat and everything. I don't see how much I paid for this hat, but was expensive. I don't know why they didn't rip my damn tag off to save my price on it. I hate when they do that. What else we got, y'all? We got more. Trust me, more to go. What about this one right here? I'll start with y'all with this one. I love this hat, too. This is a thick, thick wool hat right here, man. I love these wool hats for some reason. You, you can't go wrong with these, man. If you don't got one of these in your collection or a few of them, you lacking. But this is the this is the classic GBR Great Britain R RL Snow Polo Snow Polo Challenge Cup. This is a good hat too, y'all. Super duper thick. See England on the side of it. Got the golden horse right here. Got the got the Great Britain crest RL. What's that? Four RL four, I believe. RL four. Look, got the vintage tag in the inside it's double line got cotton in the inside this is a thick good hat man you cannot go wrong with these wool hats you see I, oh i got a bunch of them hold on let me see there we go this is what i ain't gonna lie to y'all this is one of my favorite hats when i first grabbed this joint man i grabbed this joint probably last year around like september 2021 and it was just a good all-around cat man i ain't gonna hold you it's thin it's like a thin corduroy i guess they call this a stretch corduroy thin corduroy got the colored in horse right here got the leather band in the back you know what i mean you see that you got the leather band you got this unique sweatband on it almost like heraldic like a heraldic tie. You know what I mean? It's 
Got the tag right here. New, new, new polo label. Still got the tags right there. Um, this is simple hat, man. If you got something, if you got something that's burgundy, you got something that's burgundy. This will go perfect with it, man. And it gotta be the right burgundy too. Not that, not light, not not too dark. Something to go right with this joint, man. This is a nice hat, also. All right, hold up. This is a more recent cop I just grabbed from the site not so long ago. Um, not really too much to say about this hat right here. I do like it though. I do really like this hat. I think it got some unique colors in the joint, and I do think that by the summer. This would be a popping hat to have on. I'm hoping that they might have some shorts or something like that to match this hat. Or maybe a shirt. It's a perfect joint, man. I play Wildwood, man. I, me and my family, we go to Wildwood every summer. And this would be the perfect hat to bring on that trip with us. I'd be styling with a pair of white ones, man. Y'all know what's up. Everything come with the tags if I can get it like that. New blue label. Look at the inside. Look at that blue. You got the sky blue right here. And you got like a royal blue on the sweat, man. This is a unique hat, man. They put a lot into it. All right, here we go. Look at this boy. I ain't gonna lie. This one of my, this, this is my favorite hat. Let's see that. Let's say this is my favorite hat, y'all. Right here. I'm gonna call this my favorite hat because my beautiful wife bought it for me. This is a Christmas gift for me. For my beautiful wife. I bet I was asking her for this hat for a long time. I was showing her, like, baby, look at this hat. They got an all other hat. Suede John. Can't believe it. And she was like, oh yeah, played it off. And then next thing you know, Christmas I opened up. It was I had the hat. And it's a good hat, man. It got a Southwest pattern on it. Southwest pattern. See that? Good suede. And then what really got me was the fact that... Look at this leather, man. Look at this butter leather in the inside of this hat, cousin. Like, I hope the camera is doing this joint some justice, guy. Look at this. This look like a, a pelly or something, man. You see this? This is like a pelly, a leather pelly, cousin. This butter is so soft. Look at that. You see this? This is soft butter leather, cousin. This is what crushed me. I wish this was on the outside of the head. I ain't gonna hold you. If this was on the outside, this would be heavy. But look, this is butter leather in the inside of the hat, cousin. Then the outside is like that furry suede. It's kind of like furry a little bit. I don't know if you can really get a good justice on it. But it's like a furry suede, you know what I mean? But it's a nice hat though. Official, hold up. Official double R, double RL, you know what I mean? Hold up, let me show you all the proof. What it say? This is 100% cow level right here, y'all. I ain't playing no games. This is a tough hat. And this hat ain't come cheap neither, y'all. I paid, not me, but my, well, yeah. I paid every bit of 269 for this joint. You know what I mean? Thank God, thanks, thanks to my wife, you feel me? But you know, you, if you know, you know, family. All right, hold up. I'm trying to get everything that's within my vicinity. These hats starting to stack up, though. Let me put them to the back so y'all can see how we stacking. Let me put them to the back so y'all see how we starting to stack. Hold up. I got one right here for y'all. This is another new boy. This is from to this year's edition of Polo. Man, this reminds me of an Oxford, Oxford button down. I've seen a lot of shirts that got one of these colors in it. And I've sure seen shirts that got every last one of these colors in it. But this is a good calm hat. I still got the leather. I'm at the plastic on the back. I never wore this hat yet. It's a thin hat, man. It's still winter where I'm at right now, so I'm not. I can't wear this joint yet. And it's a long bill. Look at that. You can't really tell, but this is a long bill hat right here. 
When I seen this, I said I gotta have this hat, man. This is a nice hat, dog. Got the chambray sweatband. Yeah, man. Chambray sweat sweatband. Still got all the tags in the inside. Like I said, I ain't wear this joint yet. Yeah, just a calm hat, summer hat, just like that other one right here. Hold up, I got one right here. Look at this. I had this one for a minute now. I like this one. This was one of my favorite joints right here, though. I ain't gonna lie. I had to tell myself to stop wearing this hat so I can, you know what I mean, preserve it. But this is the Cross Flags. 1967 to 1987 anniversary edition. Polo spot out of the front. This is all your navy colors, your naval colors, should I say? Got the yellow on the side. It's say RLYC, which means it's Ralph Lauren Yacht Club. You know what I mean? It's just a calm joint. Everybody, it's doing a lot though. I'm not gonna lie, it's doing a lot. The naval flag right here. We got another naval flag right here. Yep. We got the two naval flags in the front. We got the naval stripe going over across the top. Y'all won't believe I bought this hat for a dub too from Ross. I bought in Ross and found this hat for a dub, y'all. I was hype as ever when I seen this drawing. Yep. And the way this hat look is the way it was. This hat's supposed to have this. this, this like a dingy look like like a dingy look that it came with because i ain't really i never really got the joint that, that you know what i'm saying i never get none of my hats dirty cousin i ain't that boy you got me chopped i keep my stuff clean everything all right here we go on to the next joint let me see i don't want to show y'all no simple boys all right let's go with this one here this is another one of the new additions to 2022. It just dropped. This is a, what do they call this? Herringbone? I think this is like a herringbone tweed. Herring, is this tweed? I know it's herringbone. I feel like a tweed, but let me see. Let's read the tag. See if there's, there's any wool in this. Yes, this is 54% wool. So this is, we'll call this a Harris Heron Bone Tweed. Yeah. All right, so you got the Heron Bone Tweed and a tan and brown pattern with the, with the metal eyelids got the brown horse sitting right here in the back leather strap me then what killed me was the fact that it got the the plaid lining in the inside of the head this remind me of like a jacket with this lining right here and then it killed me because it also had the Polo Ralph Ralph Lauren the vintage tag in there with the vintage uh paper tag too. So we winning. Look, we stacking up, y'all. Hold on, I'm about to get had to get up to get my head. Hold up. right here it's a new boy you see it's a long brim canvas green canvas with the crest on the front got the leather strap in the back the vintage polo tag in the inside the vintage polo paper tag and it also got that plaid in the inside a soft wool plaid in the inside. This is beautiful. 
This is a beautiful hat, man. It's a nice, nice, nice winter hat. But you might can still pull this off in the summer, man, depending on how, what area you in. This is a nice hat, though. Corduroy in the front. Super duper long brim cousin. Like, this is a tooth. That's a long brim hat right here, dog. Like, you can just tell how long this brim is compared to the other drums. Which I think we done. We done yet. Still got a lot of hats to go through. Look at this. We got this joint right here. We got the Polo Bear joint, y'all. It's another one. It's my man right here. Look, he got on the... My cousin rocking it. Tartan jacket. Look at this boy, cousin. He got the sweater with the Oxford collar with the tie under it. Look like he got a pair of sneakers on, too. Cousin tripping, man. This boy got style, dog. You better stop playing with ball. Vintage cat with the, with the old leather strap, man. This leather is soft. Polo sport tag in the inside. It's a thick, thick, thick corduroy, man. You can't go wrong with it. It almost reminds me of this one a little bit. Same era hat. You can tell. Alright. Another newer cop right here. You couldn't tell me I wasn't him when I first got this hat. You couldn't tell me I wasn't him because it, it was right around Christmas time. I had a shirt to match this John. And this one of my favorite plaids right here, dog. If he got this plaid right here with the blue, yellow, and green and white, and then it got the one with the blue, yellow, green, and white and, and, and red. Oh, man. Because this is the Christmas one right here with the red in it. And then all the rest of the joints. This is, you know what I mean? All of these patterns is one of my favorites, man. All of them. And they can go with a lot of different things in the winter. I'm not sure how much you can wear this in the summer, man. But I do got some swim trunks that match this, though. So if you think I'm not wearing my joint in the summer, you got me chopped. Putting that on. Let me see. Hold up, cuz Alright, look. Told y'all that the plaid pattern was my favorite, but this is the black watch plaid. This one don't got no. The black watch plaid has no lightness in it. It has no yellow or it has no white in it. It's only dark colors. I mean, you can see it got the horse right there in black. A lot of people didn't even think this was a low hat for a fur. Let me see. Got the polo in the back. Let's see if I can get this focus done. I don't know why it's not focusing any good. And it's crazy because this is a wool hat. This is a wool hat almost just like my other wool hats. Like this one right here or this one. But the difference between this one is that it's a soft wool. Remind me like a cashmere wool or like a merino wool. It's definitely not the same thick, itchy wool like them other hats that I have. I'm gonna call this like a merino wool. Even though when I got this hat, somebody here had the tags ripped out, so I couldn't tell what this hat was. But it got the good leather strap in the back. Dark brown. Thick. Look, and it also got a nice silk lining in the inside. So. Boom. Next. This joint here. See, I say all my hats was I was hype about because I literally was hype about all my hats and I still am hype about them. I lost touch with family and friends. I was embarrassed. Look at that. You got the blue buffalo plaid. The center five panel styling. The double eyelets on the side on each side of the hat. Just a calm hat, man. Pretty thick. Made of what is this? I think this made of wool too. Oh, most of these hats is weight made of wool. This is 85% wool on this hat right here. It's a thick hat though, man. It's a thick wintertime hat. You can't go wrong with this drink. 
Oh, I got another. I got enough for another buffalo pay drink. <coughs> Excuse me. <clears throat> here we go, y'all. Got the got the red and black traditional buffalo pay right here. Y'all see how we bumming? This one just say polo, Ralph Lauren in the back. Got the black leather leather strap. It's pretty thick. Still got the tags on the inside. Paper tag. $55 MSRP boy on it. Just a good, just a good winter time hat, y'all. Can't go wrong with this joint. I got a shirt to match this hat. And polo too. My, my polo and I'm not done yet neither y'all y'all stay tuned man